In the beginning, I was pouring from a couple of half gallons at a party in, in a friend's kitchen. And uh, the person I was making a drink was saying, hey, so uh, do you like do this all the time? And I'm like, well, you know, I'm kind of like self-promoting. I'm a one-man show and you can get it out down at this liquor store over here. And they're like, no, I mean, like, do you do like parties and stuff? And I'm like, well, I mean, I kind of just show up and have some vodka in the car. And next thing you know, I'm like 10 in bar. Hey, well, would you do it at my charity event? And it was called Project Transitions and it was a, a AIDS charity and this was back in 97 or something like that and, and uh, I said sure I'll do it when so I showed up at that one and everybody was so thankful I mean everybody's like hugging me and crying and saying you know I really you know made the party and we'd auctioned off some vodka and we raised a bunch of money and it's just like really moving and just I started doing these events and everybody's just so emotional at these things and just so appreciative and thankful and everything. And so we just kind of kept doing it. And then it got to where I eventually had some employees and, and uh, they were going, well, you got to decide what charities you want to do. You know, what means something to you? And I thought about it and I just decided, it's just, Do all of them. And so it appears that we do. <clears throat> we just do all of them. So that's kind of how we got to be a philanthropic company that also sells vodka. There's not a lot of rhyme and reason, I don't think, to kind of how we do things. I always say just, you know, do things that mean something to you, you know, something that you're involved with or excited about and we're always happy to help out you know no matter what it is purpose and meaning is a big piece of it and uh, kind of once you have your normal daily expenses paid you kind of reach a point where you start hitting a wall on how happy you know you can be and uh, the more you give the more you get kind of deal you know what goes around comes around you know and if you give your people resources, they're able to go out and say thanks to their communities. And by doing that, they get thanked by their communities. And I think that it, that it gives people meaning and uh, it's great to wake up every morning and you know, your purpose is to sell Tito's handmade vodka, you know. We all like that. Well, this year, you know, once again, are all over the map, you know. Um, we've had floods all over the United States uh, that we've helped out with. You know, there are the shootings in Orlando that we raised 600 grand or something, you know. Of course, we always have the dog thing going on. We help entire tribe in Kenya, a nomadic tribe that a doctor, a friend of ours, was going to take suitcases full of Zithromax there. And they have this debilitating eye disease that causes blindness. But if you get three half doses of Zithromax, it cures it. And so we financed that to go do the first dose over there for hundreds of people. So it's all over the map, really everywhere possible. You know, I think that we're doing a good job of, you know, just trying to give back. And, you know, I love to say the cliche, make the world a better place, you know? <laughs>